What's up, mi gente? It's Friday, October 9th. This is for the Cultura. William Levy's son Christopher took a hard turn. Demi Lovato's old fling resurfaces, but first, Ricky Martin's career started on the fast lane. Before living La Vida Loca, Ricky Martin was popping wheelies in his moto in Puerto Rico. Subete a Mi Moto tells a story of 80s boy band Menudo, one of the biggest Latin boy bands in history, kickstarting the careers of Ricky Martin and Draco Rosa. The 15 episode series premieres today and follows Edgardo Diaz, the mind behind the band. Although light in essence, the series dives into the dark side of the group and Edgardo. Our Culturas icons are all getting their own series like Luis Mi or even Nicky Jam. Luis Miguel, the series which originally aired on Telemundo, is now enjoying a second life on Netflix. Earlier this week, we got a preview of another Netflix series, Selena, set to premiere December 4th. But what other artist series would you like to see? Will Demi Lovato rekindle her flame with Mike Johnson? Mike appeared on Wednesday's episode of E's Daily Pop with Justin Sylvester and spoke about sex and dating while promoting his new self-love book, Making the Love You Want. Mike Johnson, who was a fan favorite during season 15 of The Bachelorette, spoke about his short-lived romance with Demi Lovato back in September of 2019. The two became flirty with each other on social media and even went on a couple of dates, but the spark fizzled out. When Justin asked if Mike would ever rekindle the flame, he said, I'm sure that she's happy doing what she's doing in her life. I'm strictly focused on my book right now. I'm not thinking about that at all. Wish her nothing but the best. Es viernes. El cuerpo lo sabe. Let's get our drink on for Latinx Heritage Month. Mixologist Carlos Ruiz, also known on IG as Cocktails by Sea, is breaking down the history of tequila all while making a special cocktail for one of our fave celebs, Miss Becky G. And we know my paisana Becky loves her tequila. Carlos, take it away. So to get started, we're gonna smoke our glass with a little cinnamon. We're gonna light it on fire. So we're just torching the cinnamon at the moment to really get all those aromatics. And now we're gonna grab our glassware and put it right on top. The smoke is getting trapped so all those aromatics are really gonna stay in the glass. Tequila can only be made from 100% blue Weber agave or agave azul. It can only be produced in five places in Mexico. Jalisco, Nayarit, Tamaulipas, Michoacan, and Guanajuato. Squeeze half of lime into the shaker. Next ingredient is gonna be the simple syrup. We're just gonna add a quarter ounce. We have some coconut liqueur, half an ounce. This is really gonna tie in those delicious flavors of the tequila with the lime. And then for the color, the pop, and also the fruit into this cocktail, we're gonna be putting some guava juice. We're gonna be putting some Blanco tequila. Let's add some ice. Throw it all the way to the top. Think of a Becky G song. Jam out and shake up the cocktail. We bring back our glassware, strain this beautiful cocktail. I mean, the color, look at it. Perfect, 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 delicious, refreshing. We're gonna grab a lime wheel, throw it right on top, and then we're gonna grab a cinnamon stick and just lay it right on top of the lime wheel. And there you have it, a delicious cocktail made with tequila, specially made for Becky G. I hope you like it. Cheers. Ah, delicious. Listen, f what you heard, TikTok is still popping. Just ask OG Dominican Merenguero Omega Al Fuerte about his top trending jam pegao, which has hundreds of millions of results on the app. Mira, mire. Sonrío, la sonrío. Celebs like Thalia, Joe Jonas and Sophie Turner, Yuri and Gianluca have also taken on the pegao challenge. Gentis like to think they own TikTok, but these two millennials also jumped on the wave. Check out the full challenge on Telemundo's TikTok to see if we nailed it or not. Actor William Levy's 14-year-old son Chris was transported to the hospital after suffering injuries to his knees. And for the abuelas out there, you know William, your crush from Dancing with the Stars, or even as Maximiliano Sandoval from Triunfo del Amor. 
Chris was riding on a golf cart around a Weston, Florida gated community this past Sunday when the authorities say he accidentally flipped the cart over, pinning him underneath. William posted a photo Wednesday night thanking fans for the prayers and we're hoping that Chris rebounds from this to fill his father's shoes someday. Before we go, Romeo Santos will be honored with the Billboard Top Latin Album of the Decade Award during the Billboard Latin Music Awards on Telemundo this October 21st. See you Monday and have a safe weekend.